Well, North Carolina is on track for more tracks. <laughs> <laughs> the state set to receive millions of dollars in federal money to develop these new rail routes and to improve current ones. This comes at a time when Amtrak is seeing record ridership numbers in North Carolina. In Charlotte, more than 260,000 people rode the train so far this year. That's up 30% from last year. Yeah, WCNC Charlotte's Jesse Pierre is live in Northeast Charlotte with more on the funding. And Jesse, a lot of excitement about train travel. Yes, absolutely. And more people are choosing to travel by train across the state and transportation leaders are taking note and working towards improving and expanding routes so that folks can hop on a train here in Charlotte and travel to any other areas of the state. I believe rail is a part of our future. Uh, it, it has to be sustaining. It has to make sense. North Carolina is on board with improving passenger rail connection across the state. North Carolina is getting $3.5 million in grant funding to get the ball rolling. And as our country grows and our networks of roads uh, become more constricted because of the number, we're going to need all kinds of modes of travel. The North Carolina Department of Transportation submitted 12 proposals for federal funding. Seven of them are being awarded $500,000 each. This includes improvements and added stops to the Charlotte to Washington DC route, a new service from Charlotte to Atlanta, adding a route from Charlotte to Kings Mountain, and a new service from Salisbury to Asheville. Salisbury Mayor Karen Alexander says this is also an opportunity to turn the Salisbury station stop into a hub. The connection uh, that would be uh, part of Salisbury and the Asheville line would create 100,000 more passengers per year than currently. The money will be used for the development stage, cost breakdowns, and studies to determine if the projects are feasible. You want to show the likelihood of the populations that are in each of those uh, potential stops, how many uh, people would be potentially riding it, that the line. Uh, that would be very important uh, for Amtrak and for the other North Carolina railroad companies. Now, don't make your travel plans just yet. It does take time to get through that development and that studies phase. So it will be, uh, it could take several years before we get to the operational phase. However, uh, transportation leaders I spoke to say it is a necessary step to plan for the future and plan for the growth. Live in Northeast Charlotte, Jesse Pierre, WCMC Charlotte. And my mom took a train from High Point oh, to Raleigh a yeah. couple of months ago, her and her girlfriend. She liked it? She liked it. She loved it. Yeah. I can see reason for excitement. All right. I'm excited to try that out as well. Several more years, though. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse.